If home is where the heart is, a roof is its shield. That's why for nearly 30 years, homeowners have trusted Garcia Roofing. For more information, visit GarciaDidMyRoof.com. Secure your home with Storm Impact Windows, ReliefWindows.com. So women are disproportionately affected by violent crime in our community in three particular ways. Number one, one in four women is the victim of intimate partner abuse in her lifetime. One in five women is the victim of sexual assault in her lifetime. And finally, one in seven women is victim of stalking in her lifetime. These particular crimes do not affect men at the same rates that they affect women. Getting the education and the training necessary to protect yourselves is a very big thing and something I'm quite passionate about. One of the things that I really wanted to do was offer a class in concealed carry and you know there are self-defense aspects to that class for one of our most vulnerable parts of the population which are women that have been the victims of domestic violence and have orders of protection against somebody in their lives. Even though a concealed carry class is not extremely expensive for people that are going through other upheavals in their lives they're not able to overcome that monetary barrier and I really wanted to offer something that helped those people. And that's what this class is for. It is specifically for women that have been the victims of domestic violence or have an order of protection against somebody in their lives and would like to come learn how to protect themselves. We cover gun safety, gun handling, child access prevention, situational awareness, self-defense skills. It covers all of those things, but primarily it's a legal class to educate the students on how to keep themselves out of trouble. Most people are absolutely shocked what the law does and does not allow them to do and to not only go over the laws but give real life case studies from the Baton Rouge area how they went not only through <clears throat> the self-defense situation but also through the court system afterwards can be very eye-opening for people. One of the requirements by the state of Louisiana for this class is we need to cover conflict uh, de-escalation and we need to cover alternatives to firearms in self-defense. And so we talk about pepper spray, tasers, stun guns, body armor, collapsible batons, all of the things that can be used to protect somebody aside from a firearm. If I do my job correctly, someone is gonna walk away from this course with a better understanding of how to protect themselves, their family, and the laws that govern that protection. There is a shooting component to the class. They'll be required to fire 36 rounds at a person-sized target. It will be 12 rounds each at 15 feet, 10 feet, and six feet. They are welcome to bring their own firearms if they like. Uh, if not, we will be able to loan them a firearm. If we're loaning them a firearm, they will need to buy ammo from us. It's one of our insurance requirements. So there's nothing I can do about that. In Louisiana, in order to get a concealed carry permit, you must be 21 years of age or older. However, you don't have to be 21 years old to take this class. So I definitely open up concealed carry classes to anyone that wants to take it. Uh, I have a lot of parents put their teenagers through these classes simply so that they can get some education on firearms, gun safety, shooting ability, and the laws around firearms. They won't be able to apply for the license until they turn 21 and will likely have to take a class again because the certificate you get is only good for one year. Okay. However, it's very good training for anybody that wants it. If you're interested in more information about this class, it's on our Facebook page, which is Precision Firearms. In addition to that, if you would like to register for this class, you need to come into the store to do it. Uh, we do have spots available in the class, which is February 12th, Super Bowl Sunday. We did that on purpose because we wanted maybe people that that may not be able to get away on another day to have access to that. You also need to bring in for me a copy of an order of protection or a police report about domestic violence uh, just so that we know that you fall under the category that this particular class is for. We are not going to pry into your business. We're just going to glance at the paper to make sure it says what we need it to say and hand it right back to you. <laughs>